it's Lee and I'm back today with another Dollar Tree haul for you. So let me get right into it and show you all the goodies I found this time around. So the first items I picked up were the Sunkissed low calorie drink um, singles to go, the kind you pour in your water bottle. And these are an orange, peach, and mango and I picked them up because they have 1000 milligrams of vitamin C in them and they are made without aspartame and they have no sugar. And I actually saw Theoni over at Thrifty Devo's haul these and that's why I was looking for them. Next, I picked up one more of these little containers. It has some water on it. The little hinged containers. I happened to just find it in a weird spot in the store. So I picked it up to put, I've been buying fabric fat quarters at, well, wherever I can find them. So I'm gonna store them in here. And there should be plenty of space because I didn't buy that many of them. Next, I found this Nature's Garden Tropical Tropical Fruit Trail Mix. And you know what? I forgot to look and see where these are from. Chile, Philippines, South Africa, Thailand, and the US. So each of these has four individual servings. I'm gonna open this up. I got two. Just show you what it looks like. And this is what the individual serving looks like. And it says they are one ounce bags. All right, so next I picked up the Nature's Garden Mountain Mix. And excuse the chihuahuas behind me. They're running and sneezing and acting crazy. This one is, did I say trail mix? I can't even think now. A blend of salted peanuts, raisins, M&Ms, uh, salted almonds, and salted cashews. There they go. And these are a product of Chile, India, Indonesia, South Africa, USA, and Vietnam. <laughs> I forgot to say that this one has uh, banana chips, raisins, dried papaya, dried pineapple, and dried coconut. I have been trying to film this video for so long and I keep getting interrupted by people and pets and I'm just gonna keep going. So when I was in the store, I was hungry. This happens all the time, I'm hungry or thirsty and I buy something and I buy something and then I don't eat it. So I bought these, this bag of Utz Original Potato Chips. These are my favorite chips. It's a 2.875 ounce bag. And then I bought this Utz Creamy Onion Dip to go with it. This is 3.7 ounces. And yeah, I didn't, I didn't eat them. But I still have them and I'm sure they'll get eaten around here. Next, I found these disposable shoe covers and I thought they were pretty cool. I haven't seen them before or for some reason I just never noticed them before. You get 12 pairs in here and so maybe my husband will wear them when he's mowing the grass so he doesn't ruin his shoes. I don't know. I decided to get two pairs because if nothing else, I could probably put them on my hands when I get gas if I need to. I don't know. I just grabbed them. If you have any other ideas for them, let me know. I grabbed two more of the Good and Clean Disinfectant Wipes, lemon scented, and you get 30 wipes per container. Now the store I was in didn't have a limit listed, but I just picked up two packages. I also got these Hunt's Petite Diced Garlic and Extra Virgin Olive Oil Tomatoes, just to have because they sounded good. I grabbed two of them. I grabbed four pairs of these work socks for my son. It says by job site, made in Pakistan, and they are a green briar product. They just felt really thick, and I thought he would probably like them. Speaking of socks, I always say I don't need socks, but I don't need socks. I have slowed down a lot on buying them, which is good. But look at these, they're men's socks, but I'm getting them for myself. I got two pairs of these and they have bees all over them. And I just thought they were the cutest things. So I picked these up. I got two in case my daughter wanted one, but she has no more room in her suitcase. So now I have two pairs of bees. Well, my son might wear them. I might give them to him. Next, I found these Coralite Pain Relief Patches, Extra Strength Medicated Patch. And these are in small and there are 20 of them. I bought two packs and I wanna see how small they are. Oh, they are very small. And there are 20 patches in there, but still, I thought that was a pretty good deal. And it is not, it is not a uh, Greenbrier product. I'm just letting you know. 
Next, I got this Sure Sense. It absorbs odors and it's in citrus. It's a solid air freshener. Uh, yeah, I picked up one of those in citrus and one in lavender. I hope they work well. Let me know if you have tried them. I picked up two of these Sunbeam chandelier bulbs in 40 watt. And I got these, Oh, hopefully I didn't break that one. Because in my office, the lighting in there is kind of yellow. And so I thought I would just get these clear ones. The light fixture has the frosted bulbs, I believe. So I picked these up to see if that would make it better. I don't think it broke, but I don't know. I found this adorable little raccoon planter. They also had... All right, so my store had the raccoon, the dinosaur, and the narwhal, I think. I have a picture to show at the end. I know there was no sloth, because I might have gotten that. So I just picked up this one, and he has, he is Roscoe the raccoon. And um, let's see. They have Sammy the sloth, Norris the narwhal, Tyson the triceratops. So I picked that up. And then I picked up this little artificial succulent to put in him. All right, so I stole this idea from Theoni. I saw her do it on her channel. But you take this little succulent out of the pot and it fits nicely down in the little planter. Isn't that adorable? I think it's super cute. So that's going in my office. Speaking of super cute, I've seen a lot of people haul these and they just got them at, well, two of the stores I was in. I only picked up the lizard because it is so cute. It does say Greenbrier International on it, but it says wood animal. They also had, I have a picture at the end, but there's a snake, a fish, and a shark, or maybe, I don't know if it's a shark or a dolphin, um, but yeah, I'll show the picture at the end. And I just thought he was so adorable. So he's also going in my office. If you don't know, I have two lizards. I have a bearded dragon and a leopard gecko. And this reminds me of the little leopard gecko. Next, I found this headband. They also had it in, I wanna say lavender, light pink, and light blue. It's sort of a suede feel with a knot on the top. I just thought it was really pretty, so I got it. They also had some similar ones that are tied at the top, but I thought this one was cute, so I thought I'd give it a shot. These things don't always work well with people who wear glasses. <laughs> Next, I found this Germex, and it is two fluid ounces. It says kills germs in 15 seconds so the reason i picked up this size is so that my daughter can t carry it on the airplane there was a limit of four and i got these i'm going to give them to her so she'll have you know hand says hand sanitizer on a plane i grabbed a couple of these charcoal infused toothbrushes uh, these are for my son he likes one he got he really liked the one he got in, I won Theoni's men, men's giveaway and there was one in there. So I got him two more of those. I found this little bound notebook that I thought was really cute. It says brilliant ideas. It's by Jot, it has 60 sheets. It's a five by seven notebook and the pages are lined. So I grabbed it. I just liked that it said brilliant ideas. Next, I found these toning loop bands, and I picked up one in heavy, resistance level heavy, light, and medium. I've never used these. I don't know how well they work, but I do need to work on my arm strength, so I thought maybe these will be helpful. Start with the light and work my way up. So I know I've said I don't need anything Halloween or fall, but this was too cute. I'm going to put it on my front door for Halloween, maybe the week of Halloween. Halloween's on a Saturday. So a few days before, I'll put this on the door. It says, enter if you dare. They had another one, but instead of orange, the glitter was in purple. And I didn't really think you could see the enter part very well, so I picked the orange. And I think she's pretty cute. The little witch is upside down in the cauldron. So I have that. It definitely has some glitter fallout, so... If you get this, you're gonna need hairspray. And then the other fall decor I did not need <laughs> was this little scarecrow. He's so cute. It says, welcome fall. It's in blue. Isn't he adorable? So I'm actually gonna put this on my office door. I put up a hook so I could put cute stuff up there too. Next, I found some craft fabric at my store. 
I have not seen this type of fabric at my stores in a long, long time. They always have the felt, but they never have just the cotton fabric. So I picked up one of each and I got this one with the stars on it. It has a pale, pale blue or maybe gray even background and it has muted colored stars. That one is so pretty. Then I picked up this purple one with unicorns. I'm pretty sure there was one with either dogs or cats, but my store didn't have it. I would have loved that one. I think it was cats. Can't remember. Anyway, I got the unicorns with the purple background. I picked up the white background with the crayons. Does it say how big are these? 20 by 21 inches. And then I got the one with the alphabet. I thought these would be really cute for masks, put the alphabet on one side, the crayons on the other, and you could, you know, reverse the mask, have reversible masks, I mean. And then I found this Halloween themed, and as much as I was hoping we wouldn't need masks, masks by Halloween, I'm thinking we might. So I picked up this one with, with the pumpkins and jack-o'-lanterns on it, I mean, and spider webs. And then this for backing. Well, it's the only other one they had, but the orange and white gingham print. So those are all the fabrics my store had. So I picked up one of each of those. And the last items I picked up were by Hard Candy. I got this lipstick and it, I don't know if it says the color, the actual color, but this is what it looks like. It's number 1030. So I grabbed one of these. And then I found this liquid lipstick. It's Plumping Serum, Volumizing Lip Gloss. Sorry, I was wrong. And it is in number 1163. All right, so that's everything I picked up in the store. Now I have just a few pictures I'm gonna show you and then I'll meet you right back here. you enjoyed those pictures and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the little bell so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. You can also find me over on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, and Facebook at Lee's Home 05. Thanks for watching. Bye.